Hi class, welcome to my lesson on solving two-step equations. So I have two examples here just to start us off with what this looks like. So here's one example, 3x plus 7 equals 28. Notice there are two steps here. Multiplication, 3 times x plus 7. Then here we have division, 1 divided by 2x minus 4. So here's subtraction. So there are two steps right there. And for these, we're going to be solving for our variable x or any other variable that we have. So we have 3x plus 14 equals 13. This one we're going to solve. What I want you to do is think of this like a balance scale. So over here, we have our balance scale. And on one side of the equation, we have 13. So I'll just make 13 dots. You could think of them in a sense of weight. So there's 6, and there's a 13th one. So we have 13 total dots there. Now here we have 3 times x plus 4. So we'll say there are 4 dots right here to start. So I drew 4 dots there. And now we have 3 times x, whatever x is. So I'm going to make these a little bit bigger. We'll make it a little square here. And how much do those little squares weigh? So we have to figure that out. So 3x plus 4, what we want to do is undo the addition or subtraction first. We always start with undoing the addition or subtraction. So we'll subtract 4 from both sides. You have to do it to both sides because it's like a bound scale. You have to, if you subtract 4, you have to subtract 4 from the other side. And you get 3x because this cancels out. 13 minus 4 is 9. Now here it's 3x equals 9. It's again just like undoing. So we want to undo the multiplication of 3 times x. How do we undo? The opposite of multiplication is division. So we divide by 3. And what do we get? We get x equals 9 divided by 3 is 3. So that is our answer for this. So each of these little blocks that I drew here is the value of 3. And now we're buying Eagles tickets. So let's say we're going to buy Eagles tickets. You love football and you're going to go to a game. And you have $360. So $360. And how much does it cost per ticket? It's 80 per ticket. Put our little dollar signs here. It's $80 per ticket. I'm going to want a variable here. We'll use T for ticket. Plus, there's a $40 processing fee. So there's always that little extra processing fee that's not per ticket, but that's just in total with your whole purchase. So we have 80T plus 40 equals 360. And again, same thing here. We want to subtract 40 because it's adding 40. So we want to undo that operation. So minus 40, minus 40. You get 80T equals $320. And now it's multiplication. We want to undo that step. And to undo that, we divide. So we'll divide by 80. Eighty divided by eighty gives us one t, and three hundred twenty divided by eighty. You could use your calculator, and you'll get three hundred twenty divided by eighty is four. So t equals four. And what does that mean? I'm just trying to show you how this is used in real life. I'll tell you that you can bring four people with the three hundred sixty dollars that you have. So maybe you're trying to figure out. How many people can I bring to a football game, including myself? Well, if you have $360 and these are the prices, you can bring four people total. So that's a little lesson on 
solving two-step equations and how it's used in real life. Thank you very much for listening.